Hi, I'm Mona, and if you're here, you found Kaleidoscope Dreams Tarot. This is a reading for Scorpio for the first half of April 2021. I would like to say, please do not live your life by the tarot. It is you who creates your own destiny. You are intelligent, beautiful or handsome, and you are kind. These readings may or may not resonate. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share these videos. Someone may be enlightened by them. Also, to my subscribers, welcome back. And to any new subscribers, welcome to the channel. I'm so glad you're here. You are the backbone of this channel, and I greatly appreciate you. So yeah, this is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and the North Node. This is for the first half of April 2021. Let's go ahead and get started. We're going to start here with the Healing Oracle. Find out just what kind of energies come out from this. Most likely they will apply to the reading. Whoa! This was a hand fumble for sure. Let's fix these, you guys. All right. Sorry about that. Let's go ahead and just try this again. I try to keep a good grip because, you know, these are roundies. It's kind of... <laughs> it's a little hard. Okay. This is for Scorpio for the first half of April 2021 for Scorpio. There we go. Ah! <laughs> okay. Didn't burn. It's okay. <laughs> All right. So we do have keep your morals, right? Do you have any? If you do, do not let anybody switch up your morals, right? If you like to do things a certain way, because it's good for you, it's safe for you, it's, you know, virtuous, whatever the situation. Keep your morals. Don't let anybody switch that up. Once somebody allows, or once you allow somebody to change your morals, then that is toxic. All right? I'm going to say right off the bat. Okay? I'm just saying. You were born to succeed. Yes, you were. All right, and this is where the keep your morals comes in too. You will succeed if you keep your morals and you go with your own gut, with your own intuition, right? Know that everyone suffers, not just you express compassion. So maybe you might be going through a hard time right now and somebody might even come up to you and ask for your opinion or maybe they need an ear to talk to. So, you know, don't, you know, be upset or whatever or bring in your sad story. Somebody else is suffering and they're going to you for, you know, for solace. They want to speak to somebody, you know what I mean? And they're not there to compete for who's had the worst experience. They just need an ear for right now. Um, so just know that people will maybe approach you and tell you their little, maybe they like to tell you their problems. Maybe you are somebody who draws people to you and they just unload their whole, <laughs> their whole problems on you. Well, you know, sometimes people just need an ear and that's very nice if you do allow, uh, allow that. The best thing you can do is to know yourself, right? That's right. Maybe, uh, do you, let's hope that you're not spending too much time getting to know others and you don't know yourself, Right. Maybe you're getting to know too many other people because you want to do what the other people are doing. You want to make sure that you are doing the right thing. But you know what? Do what's in your, in your heart, in your gut, in your intuition. That's the right thing because whatever anybody else is doing, that's what's good for them. It doesn't necessarily mean it's good for you. You know what I mean? All right. So these cards are pre-shuffled. Tarot of Dreams, right? We're going to go ahead and get one shuffle in. We're going to find out. Uh, general energy for Scorpio for the first half of April 2021. Remember, you guys, take what resonates, leave the rest. Don't manifest any kind of weird stuff into your life, okay? All right. General energy for Scorpio for the first half of April 2021 is... Ooh, the Seven of Swords. It appears that somebody may feel defeated. They may feel deceived, lied to, cheated on. Uh, if that's your energy... Um Maybe you, maybe you want to do this to somebody, or maybe somebody wants to do this to you. This is, we have the sign of Aquarius here. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. Um, and, uh, it could also be the moon sign. Doesn't have to be, but moon and Aquarius, or it could just be Aquarius, whatever, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node. But this person or this situation involves lying, cheating, deception, all the bad stuff. Okay. That's that energy. Let's find out what's going on. What's going on for Scorpio for the first half of April 
2021 for April 2021 for Scorpio. For Scorpio, please, for the first half of April 2021 for Scorpio. One more for Scorpio, please. Mmm, just like Scorpio, to keep it a mystery, right? All right. The bottom of the deck, we have the Eight of Cups. So we got past, present, future. Here it is. Somebody may have deceived you or you deceived somebody. And it had to do with love. You may have, uh, you may have not started a new start in love. You may have promised it and it just never got off the ground because somebody walked away. So you could have been in a situation that somebody wanted love, but somebody walked away from it. Now the signs we have here are Aquarius and Pisces or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. All right. So let's find out what's going on here. Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. No new starts when it comes to financial stability. No new starts when it comes to love. Somebody here is not is willing to work on themselves that's why so you're dealing maybe with somebody who or vice versa you guys <clears throat> you could be dealing with somebody who is just not somebody who is ready for anything they're just you know they have no goals they just want to go around and fool around and play around and they don't have no future goals and i'll tell you what ain't none of us getting it any younger so you can trust if you're a handsome or you're dealing with someone who's handsome or, or beautiful, you can trust that that will go away. Okay? And the longer you wait and the longer you play around and you're in that state of mind, you can just know, you know. And you guys, sorry if the, I just noticed that the camera might actually be showing that it's sideways, but just listen to the reading. <laughs> I don't want to stop it. This is, you know. It's not worth me to stop it. Let me try to see if I could do something. I think that worked. But it's still, the reading is the same, you guys. So anyways, so yeah, somebody is refusing to work on themselves. They don't want new starts. They just want to be around and goofing around and being, you know, lying, cheating, stealing. This is somebody who's bad energy, right? Bad energy. Uh, always look at the seven of wands always defensive when it comes when somebody says hey what about let's talk about love or let's talk about stability this person always gets defensive now this is either you or them but that's the situation no one is this person never wants to work out anything with anyone because they want I think it's about uh, oh look page of swords we have the spy somebody never wants to work anything out with anyone and all they do is spy. Someone is very bad when it comes to expressing emotions. All right. Somebody is not good at all. Somebody here could also be um, slander, talking smack, uh, gossiping about others, about someone. Right. Just saying bad stuff about them because it's kind of like. And you know what came to my mind? It just came to my mind. You guys, you know when sometimes when I'm doing the readings, right? Sometimes when I'm doing them, I will like something bad will happen and I will chuckle, right? But I'm telling you guys, and I and I'll usually say, it's not because I'm laughing at the pain of what's going on. It, I have a nervous thing, right? When something goes bad, I tend to la try. To, I don't mean to, but I laugh. You know, and then I turn around and say, oh, I didn't mean that it was funny. I just, you know, it's a nervous thing. And that's, I, I need to fix that somehow because I don't want people to think I'm laughing at their pains because I'm not. It's kind of like a, like a little stressed out and I, I chuckle a little bit, but it's really not that. It's, I'm not trying to, you know. So maybe this person doesn't know how to start stability, doesn't know how to start. This person could live with their parents or constantly be going back to their parents because they don't know how to get off the ground or feed off the ground. And, you know, whose fault is that? We don't come out of the wound knowing how to take care of ourselves, right? Just saying. Um, yeah, look at that. Four of Wands in the reverse. Somebody actually uh, was not good with their soulmate. Or they were dealing with a karmic. And 
if it's a if they were dealing with a soulmate who walked away, it's because they were non-committal. There's no future. There's no goals for stability. This person was always defensive. Maybe you thought you had to deal with a lot of competition. Maybe there was a lot of gossip and shit talk around you. You know, and you know this could this could actually be karmic situation. Whoever you're dealing with, this maybe is Aquarius or something or Pisces. Those are karmics because there's no happiness coming out of this, right? And these people could have made you mess up your morals. Uh, stunted your growth to succeed, right? This, these people probably didn't even care or have any compassion for you. And, and, and maybe you lost yourself for a minute there, you know? And we all do at, at some times in our life, you know? But you can fix it. You sure can. You can fix it. Separate from all those that do not serve. Why is this uh, Ace of Coins? No. Why is this Eight of Coins in the reverse? Somebody doesn't want to work on something, but they want to spy on someone that they they have a soulmate tie or a soul bond or something with, right? Eight of coins. What are they watching? They're not definitely not bringing in any sort of truth. Number one, they're watch they're watching maybe their partner. Uh, they're possibly. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> They're possibly juggling right now. They, they don't even want to work on themselves. I told you this person just want to go around and do their thing and have fun and not even think about the future. We got a king of swords here. This person may be a controlling individual, you know, could be a little bit manipulative at a time, overthinker. Nine of cups, this person possibly has a whole bunch of wish fulfillments all over the place. Look at, yeah, all over the place. Taking a leap of faith, going wish fulfillment here, going wish fulfillment there. A lot of wish fulfillments everywhere. This is selfishness and excess, you guys. So why is the Seven of Wands here then? Why is the Seven of Wands here? Seven of Wands. Seven of Wands. Oh, so we have two nines. We have a Nine of Pentacles lady or guy, single individual, abundant, that can take care of themselves. Somebody was very defensive with this person, right? So this may be uh, one of the ladies or one of the guys, right, that somebody was dealing with. Uh, we have the Nine of Swords. Somebody is trying to figure out what happened, what went wrong. Well, it's because there was no Ace of, of Pentacles and no Ace of Cups. That's what went wrong. Somebody didn't want to work on something. They just wanted to go around and have fun all the time and, and, and gossip behind someone's back. And then when somebody finally met up with their soulmate, <clears throat> down the tube they didn't even treat that soulmate right and they may have lost this opportunity to be quite honest i'm surprised that the four of uh cups isn't flying out what do we have for this uh four of rods four of rods here why is this four of rods in the reverse four of rods Because, oh, well, we have the, the Knight of Wands in the reverse, okay? This is about, I want to be a player no more, right? King of Cups in the reverse, so that's you. And the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse, so darn. I'm kind of feeling like it was you, Scorpio, that didn't bring in this cup of love, that didn't bring in this stability, that refused to work on themselves, that was having an issue with the single lady, that you can't figure out what went wrong here. You may be gossiping about this person, uh, slandering, uh, things like that. And this was your soulmate, or it could have been a karmic tie, you know, karmic bond. Now, if that's not you, it's the other person. Flip-flop the energy is how you feel, right? Mm-hmm finally find out what the angels and hands ancestors have to say about this situation right angels and ancestors what do you got to say for scorpio for the first half of april 2021 please heart guardian love and let yourself be loved okay but you're not going to get that if you don't allow it. We got the Ace of Cups in reverse, Ace of Pentacles. This is about longevity, starting something new in longevity, uh, stability, love, emotions. But you're not allowing it. You might have closed off heart, okay? Shaman, trust the higher forces. Yes, consult with spirit, you guys. Come on now, you know. 
consult with spirit, ask what's going on there, how you can fix things, go within, do some meditation, whatever you need to do to get that conversation with spirit going, or before bed, pray to the archangels, whichever one. I like to refer to Archangel Metatron or Archangel Michael uh, before I go to bed and ask them to assist me with uh, receiving messages. That works for me. Could work for you. I don't know. Guardian Angel, you are not alone. You are not. I told you. You see, because you, you, if you're going to be consulting with your spirit guides or, you know, with God, angels, universe, whoever it is you pray to, you know, they got your back. You just got to, uh, you got to ask for their help, though, okay? You got to ask for it. So that's all I have for you, Scorpio. Now, remember, you guys, please subscribe, like, comment, and share. It does help the channel grow. Also, keep it true love energy. Happy, friendly, and loving types. And we have nothing to fear as long as we stay calm and cheerful, right? Right. I'm Mona. This is Kaleidoscope Dreams Tarot, and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.